Um, so again, remember um, when we're looking at this, and there's a couple different things that we want to write down um, that we can say is when we're looking at this, yes, we know it's a velocity graph. We see that the velocity on this interval between 4 and 5, we see that the velocity is going to be positive, but we also know that the acceleration is negative. So a couple things that we'd want to write down, or at least how we'd write that down, is you could write in that v of t is going to be greater than 0. And a sub t is less than 0 on the interval. a of t represents the acceleration, which is going to be the slope of that particle. On the interval, 4 is less than t, which is less than 5. Hence, the speed of the particle is decreasing on 4 is less than t, which is less than 5. Okay, so that is basically, if you guys can look at it, it's a kind of obvious thing you guys can look at that. But the main important thing that I wanted to come across to you guys as well is, is writing that in a nice little formal manner.